I thought it might be quite fun to kick off week five with me quickly showing you my, my kind of my daily process when it comes to emp.money. Now, I don't claim every day. In fact, I haven't claimed for the last few days because I wanted to let some interest build up really for this video. Uh, but I'll show you what I look at every day. And uh, I do make notes every day. I always make notes of, uh, of the interest just so I'm aware over time kind of how the, how the whole protocol is going. But let me show you. Uh, so we're going to jump between the farm and the boardroom right now. And I will claim and uh, I will restake as well. And I'll show you what I do with the EMP. EMP and the e-shares. So let's go through all that good stuff right now. So let's jump to emp.money. Okay, and here we are. And let's go to the farm firstly. And uh, let's jump into the farm itself, EMP ETH farm. So let's have a little look at this. Now, again, I, I have said this before in previous videos. I, I know I've got a little bit, you know, state here. So I don't want you to think, oh, Chris, it's all right for you. You've got quite a lot of state. I do get that. I do get that. But again, as I've said a thousand times, it's the process that I really want you to kind of get comfortable with. And you may well have done what we're about to go through in this video. So I will do this relatively quickly. So here we are uh, looking in the farm. And here is how much e-share I have to claim or how much I've earned. I haven't claimed it yet. Uh, so $805. This is over about four days. I don't think I've claimed for four days or so, just so you know. And the APR, you know, it's pretty good. Well, it's, I mean, that's, isn't it awful now? We're beginning to think 0.43. Oh, it's pretty good. I mean, that's exceptional. Um, I have seen it higher, though. I have also seen it lower. So uh, we're going to claim this e-share. Now, of course, where's the e-share going to go? You tell me. When I claim the e-share, where will it go? It will go... Well done, if you said MetaMask, correct. So let's click on MetaMask. And this is my actual MetaMask rather than the test one I set up uh, for this uh, four-week crypto mastermind. So you'll see some other assets in here. And what am I looking for? I'm looking for eShare. So I've got zero, here we are, here we are. So I've added the contract address. So there's no eShare there at the moment, fine. So let's go and claim. Um, so let's go and do that firstly. So the first thing I do is I start in the farm and uh, claim. And you can stake and claim in the farm at any time. It's not locked, although in the boardroom, there is a lock when you stake and when you claim, but we'll come to that in a second. So let's claim this e-share. So this will go to zero in a second, and the 0.47 e-share will appear in MetaMask. I'm gonna click claim. Mr. MetaMask head will appear. Let's scroll down, let's click confirm. We're getting faster at this now, aren't we? And um, again, I've said this before, sometimes when you click MetaMask, nothing may happen for 10 or 15 seconds. That's normal, it's the blockchain doing its stuff. Look, we get this little message, it says claim e-share, it's exactly what we're doing. Uh, watch this here, this will disappear. There we go, gone. And uh, it's still claiming according to this countdown, but if I go to MetaMask, uh, you will see that the e-share is there, there it is. It's there a second ago. Uh, okay, great. So that's the first thing. So uh, the farm is now zero. It's, all, it's always a little bit sad, I think, when you've kind of built up interest for a few days and you zero it. I mean, I know it's, I know we still got it in our wallet, but do you feel the same? Something nice about seeing it, isn't, isn't there? But uh, anyway, we probably need to get over that. So uh, we start in the farm. We earn the e share and we claim it. Great. Now let's stake that claimed e share in the boardroom. And here we are. So let's have a little look around the boardroom. What have we got here? So firstly, let's see the balance. So I've got, uh, at the time of making this video, 33 e-share here, which has got a dollar value of about, uh, oh, it just went down a fraction, 57,000, well, $56,989. So yes, I, I know it is quite a lot. I do understand that. But again, as I've also said, I didn't start with this. I started with about 10,000 and I put another 7,000 in and the rest of this has all been compounded over time. Uh, but it is still quite a decent amount. I understand that. And uh, the peg is over one, so it is printing, and the APR is very high. And I haven't claimed for four days. I haven't claimed for the farm or the boardroom for four days. And at the moment, I've got $6,471 in pure passive income waiting for me to claim. I mean, it's just it's mind-blowing, isn't it, really? So one thing to know about the boardroom, and again, every bit of EMP.money has got their own little thing. So if you're making notes, you might want to make a note of that, or of this rather. And that is that when we stake, the boardroom automatically locks for, I think it's 18 hours. So therefore, that means that I couldn't access my EMP unless I claim it first. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm going to claim this first, and then I'm going to stake the eShare uh, that we just uh, claimed from the farm a second ago. So uh, let me just quickly look at MetaMask to see how much EMP we've got at the moment because it will increase in a second when I uh, claim this EMP that we're looking at here. So let's just scroll down here. EMP, is that 14,000 or 1,400? No, it's 14,000. So I've got 14,000 uh, EMP tokens. I'm about to add another 13,000. So let's go and do that. This will zero and we'll see this balance go up to 
close to 30,000. Um, so let me do that. I'm going to click Claim Reward and confirm on MetaMask. And again, the more we do this, the more kind of confident and comfortable we get, don't we? So I've clicked uh, twice there on MetaMask and it will chug on through and it's thinking about it. There we go. So it says it's claiming EMP from the boardroom. And again, the more you do this, the more I'm sure you're getting used to understanding what all this is actually meaning. We are claiming from the boardroom. This will zero here in a couple of seconds time. So let's take a little look out for that. Sometimes it takes a few seconds to go. There we go. So it's gone. Uh, let's just check it's in MetaMask. Well, it definitely will be. Let's click on Assets. There it is, almost 30,000 EMP. By the way, we haven't really looked at this, but we'll take a look at this later. There is an Activity tab also in MetaMask. If I click on that, this is all your transactions, money that you've sent in, withdrawn, claim reward. Um, but we'll take a brief look at that a bit later here in week five. Uh, for now, though, I don't want this video to be too long. Now, you tell me, what will be the, the final thing we're going to do now? The final thing. Brilliant. If you said we're now going to stake the Isha that we earned from the farm, you're correct. So let's do that really quickly. So we've got 33, let me write this down. We've got 33.89 E-share. I'm going to click on the little uh, plus symbol. And again, as soon as we stake, this will all lock for 18 hours. You'll see this in a second. So let me click plus. There's the E-share that we've just claim from the farm. Let me click max. Again, the more we do this, the more it kind of becomes quite a fun process. I know there's a bit to it. I've clicked, I've clicked on confirm. Let me scroll on MetaMask. Let me click on confirm in MetaMask. And now what we're doing is we are staking the, you know, the free e-share um, from the farm to add to the boardroom, which is going to pay even higher APR in EMP when the peg is over one. Uh, so we're staking. So this is going to go up in a second to 34.3. It takes often a few seconds for that change to be seen. This is the bit, isn't it? That Have you found this? You, it can be a little bit almost like, gosh, has it, have I broken the blockchain? Have I broken the, the internet? No, you haven't. Sometimes it just takes a little bit of time. Uh, but the good thing is that everything we do does leave a transaction on the blockchain. There we go. So you can't kind of lose anything. You may not possibly know what you've done, but there is a footprint everywhere. So now we state the e-share, which is wonderful. So all we're now left with is really what the whole of this uh, bonus week five is about. What we are left with is an ever increasing amount of EMP that we're generating that we don't really ever want to sell. So what do we do with that? That's really the whole purpose of uh, this bonus week five. So um, let's wrap up, let's summarize. And what did we accomplish in this video? Well, I showed you in real time what I do personally, and again, not financial advice when it comes to the farm and it comes to the boardroom. And I hope you found it uh, interesting to see. What do I want you to do now? Nothing, 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 nothing. I just wanted to kind of show you the, the process. And again, when you do this day in, day out, or at least if you look at your emp.money account day in, day out, you'll, you'll begin to get really familiar with what's going on. And, and I'm sure you're, you're beginning to grasp it, but I'm also sure at times you're thinking, oh, hang on, I need to look at my notes again. I can't quite remember. That's completely normal. It took me like five or six months of doing this, you know, a lot to really make it cement in my mind. Okay, right. How are you feeling? Let me know below, please. We'd love to know. See you in the next video.